what's the deal, everybody? Welcome to the broadcast. Gotta say, I should pot should buy some pot. Say, on the government respect, that quality of the choir coming at you back again with another exciting video. The NFL draft was yesterday, too. I gotta make the Raiders video. I'm slagging. All right, but here we go. Today's chakra is light blue. Okay, it's the throat chakra, it is located within your throat. Okay, right here, this is the chakra. This is the whole chakra. <clears throat> so, what you do is to activate this chakra is say ham. As H A L. Ham. 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 Now, <clears throat> this chakra is communicates effectively. You want to be able to communicate effectively your desires. You want to be able to communicate effectively your uh, your security, your stability. You want to be able to communicate effectively your heart, your love. You want to also be able to communicate effectively you yourself and communicate effectively. You you you, you want to be able to communicate all the other energies effectively, so that you can develop your connection to spirit and activate your kundalini. And that's how it works. That's why you work on the chakras, and that's why you say the mantras. Blueberries, blackberries, coconuts, water, raw honey, and apples are some of the chakra, some of the energies of the chakras that you can use for today. Okay, when you when you shy, you, okay, you can't be shy. So you would say ham. To not be shy, you would say ham. All right, being withdrawn, arrogance, being withdrawn, and having arrogance. Okay, so to effectively get rid of arrogance, or if you Basically, to get to effectively get rid of any of these flaws, shyness, being withdrawn, arrogance, increased anxiety, expressiveness, telling lies, not able to listen. If you're dealing with any of these problems, or you're dealing with any one of these problems, you can say ham, ham. What are mantras? Ham is a mantra. What are mantras? Mantras are an effective vibrational frequency sound. That has magical powers to specifically eliminate shyness, being withdrawn, arrogance, increased anxiety, expressive expressiveness, telling lies, and not able to listen. So anybody that's dealing with any problems of anybody in your vicinity or area to increase the law of attraction and to eliminate the shyness, being withdrawn, arrogance, increased anxiety excessiveness, telling lies, not able to listen, you would say, ham, ham, that's H-I-M, ham, to communicate effectively, speaking clearly, effectively in expression, you would say, ham, ham, so in the Bible it says we fight against the spirit and not against the flesh, in order to contain the spirit of Shyness, being withdrawn, arrogance, increased anxiety, expressiveness, telling lies, and not able to listen, you will say, ham, H-A-M. So basically, it's no need to argue, no need to fight, no need to get mad, no need to be around. No, if you're dealing with people that's not listening to you, you don't have to yell. You don't have to express yourself in a yelling voice. You can magically make people listen to you by saying, ham. First thing in the morning and throughout the day, you will constantly say ham. Once your subconscious mind hears, and when you see how effective it is with saying ham, then it will stop with the yelling. And, this, and you, there's to get your power, you don't have to really express you. To get your power, there's magical ways to get your power. And this is why you will say mantras. But you have to learn what each mantra is. There's seven main mantras. I mean, there are at least more than seven. But specifically within your body, other beyond the crown or the connection, the spirit crown chakra, there are seven. Okay, and all of these sevens are specific instructions on how to emotionally, effectively manifest. Okay, which is the tree of life. So everybody is concealed into the cliff off. You're born into the the tree of life concealed to you. When you raise your vibrational frequencies, and the basically this is how you manifest. Once you master this, once you learn each one of these fears, if you master this, you learn the ability to be able to power to manifest. 
that manifestation comes through consciousness. Consciousness is the part of your brain connected to your cerebral vertebrae, which is the back of your neck. The back of your neck is important because it's connected to your spinal cord. Your spinal cord is important because that is the cord, the power that plugs in your heart to your brain, which is your computer. Your soul enters your body, which is the computer, your mainframe. The soul enters your brain. Consciousness and the part of your soul that's beyond your brain is the part that's within your consciousness. That part is concealed to you. That is the part that you are not supposed to receive. You're supposed to automatically hear, sight, see, smell, taste, and feel. But when consciousness is revealed to you, you develop a sixth sense, which is your third eye, which we will talk about in tomorrow's perfect segue episode of the third eye. So what you want to do is work on him, him. The third eye is about intuition, vision. Okay, intuition, vision, and perception. Okay, we'll discuss about those tomorrow. And on that note, make sure you understand that I love myself. Peace to the most gods, blessing to the most high Baba G. Oh, I almost forgot affirmations for today. My voice matters. Now, affirmations are important because affirmations help you replace negative ideas with positive ideas. Okay, so when you're in your brain and you're in your mind and you think of a negative idea, what you would do is say a positive idea with an affirmation. Now, my voice matters. My words are powerful. I express myself clearly and openly. I carry myself in take with integrity. I, my voice matters. My words are powerful. I express myself clearly and openly. I carry myself with integrity. So, these are the things that you can say to help replace negative thoughts with positive thoughts because you have the power to manifest. Once you have the power to manifest, you have the power to create your desires. When you create your desires, that is a chakra. That's actually a chakra. A chakra. You develop your security. Your security is your root chakra, which is lamb. So you have lamb, vam, and then you go to the I can chakra. The I can energy, and I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me, is the solar plex chakra, which is ram. Ram. Then you move on after you graduate from that energy, you move on to the next energy, whether it's the heart chakra, you teach yourself how to love and express yourself and love yourself and love others because you can't love yourself without loving others. So that is the yam, yam. Then you go to the throat chakra, which is the energy, which is you communicate, express yourself, communicate all your chakras effectively. Communicating and expressing yourself through all your chakras effectively, which is ham. That's why ham is important. Then you go to the third eye, which is your vision, your intuition, your perception. Perception is the only thing that is reality. You control and manifest your material world. So you go into the um, um. Then you go into the um, which is your spiritual connection tapping into the most high. I love myself. Peace to God, Baba D.